All right, I have a Milwaukee Bolt Eye Visor. This is a clear one. It's going to go on my really cool Milwaukee helmet, safety helmet. Okay, there's two parts that came with it, the visor and a little bracket. This visor will not work with the standard clip that comes on here to take that off and basically it goes on just open it up in front of you so this is behind this is in front of the back brace here and then it has little clips here and so it just slides on the helmet and then there's a lock here you push this you can see the little red mark push it over and it locks on there okay and then you can stow it up here like that and you can use it okay I'm gonna stow it up like that pull it down I'm gonna use it pull this down and try to go back with it as far as you can on this side and then you can get the the uh, goggle right on visor right on your nose or go up to the helmet and on your nose so it blocks that off it's clear anti-scratch material pull it down Oops, go forward you just put it out of your way like right here go up whatever you want to do they make them in a couple of colors. They make a tinted one also. Now, when I want to use this with a light, this is not going to go back on. They include this thing. It's a little clip. And it will slide right over here and clip into here. There's a little sewn on elastic band. And if you have some kind of light, you know, it has to have a little slot here to fit on here. So let me put this on real quickly. Okay, I didn't know this had a little split in here also. Well, that's nice. That makes it getting these on a little bit easier. But push it through the little clip on your light like that. And then this goes back on here the same way. Just loop it over. Loop it over. Okay. Got a light. All good. Now when we want to put it on the helmet. Again, it has these little clip areas. They just slide back on. And it snaps in. Okay. This little lip thing snaps right over. Turn it on. Nice. Nice helmet. The clear lens. More comfortable pivoting visor angle, raise and lower with headlamp mounted, lasting fog free interior coating. A couple of notes when you're washing the visor, wash visors with water and pat dry with a lens cloth. Do not use ammonia. Alkaline cleaners, abrasive cleaning compounds, or solvents when cleaning visors. Some solvents may lower the impact resistance of the visors. These are 99.9% .9 UVA, UVB, and UVC. That's pretty good. Here's a list of the product numbers in case you want to order more visors or helmets or replacements a couple more points these this visor is not to be used for protection against chemical mist sprays splashes or vapors obviously they're not anywhere close to being airtight on your face not to be used for sports or combat games like paintball okay 
And by the way, when I store this helmet in the bag, I'm taking it off. I like to put my little parts inside of the helmet. Put my little work vest in here, safety vest. That way nothing gets scratched while it's moving around in my backpack. Okay, let me show you how to take these lenses off. It took me a couple times to figure it out. You can see inside here, there's this little tab. You push both of them in. And when you're pushing, this whole thing's going to slide out. It's a little picky. You, you, when you push it in enough, it's in there past the lip of the metal, I mean, lip, lip of the plastic. And then just come up here, put your thumb here, it slides out. Put your thumb on this little tab, and it slides out. It's not soft plastic, it's hard plastic, so be careful. It has a picture of an unlock on it. Okay, now when we put it back in, we want to slide it into this tab, but also into this little slot and this slot. So just line it up a little bit. This will go all the way in here. And then here also pops in. Make sure you're getting them pushed in even on both ends. There we go, snaps in.